Again, we're going to talk a little bit, uh, going to geek out a little bit about the science. Let's cover what the HPA axis is. HPA axis stands for hypothalamus pituitary adrenal axis. What functions does it play? Well, it helps the body deal with stressors. Very simple. The old, uh, the old example of uh, the caveman sees the tiger and he gets scared, he runs away, or he fights it. The fight or flight response is actually now considered even, they've identified the freeze response. When things, they get so scared, they just freeze up. Think about when animals play dead. That's a defense. Hey, that is actually the, the stress side. That's not the parasympath parasympathetic side, which is the rest and digest and detox type of things. So how does the HPA axis work? Well, the H, the hypothalamus is connected to the pituitary. It's in the brain. It sends a, a signal. They connect between each other. And then the pituitary sends a signal to the adrenals. 